shoes. Here's how to shoot a full stop underexposed so that when I pull everything back to a proper exposure, all the settings are exactly how I want them. You have a little exposure monitor in the top and on the back panel of your camera. So the middle bar in our exposure meter lets us know that our image is properly exposed. For my editing workflow and my personal preference, I like to shoot a full stop underexposed and there's a negative three to a positive three. I'm gonna shoot back down to in between the negative three and the negative two. So when I shoot underexposed, I always zoom in to the preview and just make sure the focus is where I wanted and that there's information there. Information in the pixels is great and it's always safer to shoot underexposed than overexposed. If you blow out your highlights, there's literally no information in the pixel to recover. Whereas if you underexpose, there's plenty of information in the pixels, you just have to change it. 